Hey what's up everybody I hope you all are doing absolutely fine this is Rudraditya and this is the camera comparison of nothing phone one and one plus nord and currently you are watching the sample from the phone itself this is 4K 30fps from the prime memory lens of the rear camera of course and this is 4K 30 do let me know the audio is also coming right from both these phones so do let me know what you guys think about the video quality and the audio quality and now I'm going to show you a lot of photo samples video samples so stay tuned in this video hit the like button and let's begin well guys before showing you the photo samples let's talk about the camera specification so nothing phone one comes with dual camera setup and oneplus nord 2 comes with triple camera setup but when it comes to functionality it's just the opposite i mean you will get three modes in nothing phone one and in oneplus nord 2 you will get two modes the main primary lens you can shoot in wide and then ultra wide this these are the two modes which you will get in one plus not two whereas in nothing phone one you will get three modes wide ultra wide and then macro mode which is also hidden in the ultra wide lens so that is pretty cool and in nothing phone one you will get 50 megapixel primary lens with f1.88 apertures with sony imx 766 sensor and the ultra wide lens is also 50 megapixel f2.2 and uh, yeah that's it you will get eis in ultra wide and ois in primary lens now in uh, oneplus nord 2 you will get 50 megapixel sony imx 766 same f1.9 aperture lens in the primary lens but in the ultra wide lens you will get 8 megapixel f 2.2 aperture and uh, the field of view is 120 degree so that's nice whereas in nothing phone one you will get 114 degree field of view and then the third lens in oneplus nord 2 is 2 megapixel depth f 2.4 which is basically useless lens so that's why i really like the you know functionality of nothing phone one and also it's more versatile as compared to oneplus nord 2 and i clicked a lot of photos to make a proper judgment i just didn't click you know eight or ten photos and then i said my opinion no i you know tested these two phones in a lot of scenarios and now finally i am here in this video so the video is going to be a bit longer but if you are interested in this comparison i hope you are going to like it so now without wasting any time let's start all right so starting first with the primary lens in daylight scenes then in the first photo you can clearly see that oneplus nord 2 is looking more pleasing to the eyes because of its you know more boosted colors and also it manages the sun you know the exposure of the sun more properly as compared to nothing phone one on the other hand nothing phone one is more closer to the reality but you know the colors are looking dull as compared to nord 2 so definitely i would go with the oneplus nord 2 in this pic in the second photo again i mean both phones took a very good photo but there is a different in the skies i mean the skies are more blue in nothing phone one as compared to oneplus nord 2 and the details are like almost equally good in both the phones so it's really tough to choose but in this photo in this particular photo i will go with nothing phone one because if you look at the left side uh, between those two trees you can see that the overall light control the exposure of the sun is a little bit better as compared to oneplus nord 2 so that's why i will pick nothing phone one in this pick now in this photo i will again go with nothing phone one because of better white balance and also the skies are a little bit saturated now in this photo again sunlight comes into the chat and oneplus nord 2 is the winner because of the better exposure and also because it's a bit you know pop up the colors are boosted and in nothing phone one i noticed that whenever sunlight comes into the chat you know it tends to just dull the overall color of other things like the grass and ground and the skies so good job oneplus nord 2 here now in this photo again you can see that there is not much of a difference the difference is only of the tone you you will see you know warmer tone in oneplus nord 2 whereas nothing phone one is very you know neutral and very close to reality so it's personal preference like which type of image you like more and according to that you can pick any of these if i have to pick one i will pick nothing phone one in this particular image now a picture of a greenery with you know a skies and buildings in the background so this is a very good picture to test and you can see that how much you know saturated the picture comes in oneplus nord 2 whereas nothing phone one looks dull but again it's close to reality so when sunlight comes nothing phone one you know tends to pick dull pictures but in this image also i noticed that when the greenery is too much in the foreground and i mean in the majority of the picture the oneplus nord 2 took a saturated photo whereas nothing phone one is not that saturated so it's upon to you well you know of course not two is looking more pleasing to the eyes to me well do let me know what you guys think and now let's move ahead to the next pick 
Now in this pick, I can say that overall OnePlus Nord 2 is better, although the skies, the highlights of the skies are, you know, managed properly in the Nothing Phone 1. But if you see the other things like the, you know, land and grass and also that tower, the details on the tower is very good on Nord 2, whereas Nothing Phone 1 is just failed to take any details. So definitely OnePlus Nord 2 is the winner in this particular picture. Now in this image again I can see some difference in the skies and also in the you know foreground but not much of a difference it's really hard to pick that which one is looking good both are a bit different but both are looking good to me do let me know what you guys think about this particular image it's really confusing to me. <laughs> Now in this image again as I show you the previous picture now the greenery comes and OnePlus Nord 2 took a very saturated picture whereas nothing phone 1 control the overall picture quite well and you can see again warmer tone in Nord 2 whereas in nothing phone 1 you can see uh, overall very good white balance so the white balance control in nothing phone 1 is fantastic and because of that this time I will go with nothing phone 1 and in this one uh, I mean it's really hard to judge that which one is better both took a very you know identical looking picture but if you zoom at the trees you can see that not to did a better job but there is over sharpening as well so yeah do let me know what you guys think about this one now here is a very good photo this time nothing phone one took a bit saturated photo so i can say both these phones are very you know inconsistent sometimes one plus nord 2 take you know more saturated boosted colors sometimes nothing phone one takes more boosted and saturated colors and against the sunlight you can always see that the dynamic range of nothing phone one is not that great as compared to one plus nord 2 but there is not much of a difference like in this photo you can see some flares in the sort of one plus nord 2 whereas in nothing phone one the flares are a little bit less as compared to Nord 2 but overall I mean in terms of picture quality I can say nothing phone one is looking better in this but still dynamic range is you know a little bit better in OnePlus Nord 2. Now in this picture again it's really hard to judge this time nothing phone one picks a bit you know warmer tone whereas Nord 2 pick a little bit cooler tone so I can tell you one thing that both are looking very inconsistent sometimes Nord 2 is more saturated sometimes nothing phone 1 is more saturated now here you can see nothing phone 1 is warmer and one plus Nord 2 is cooler so what's going on wow <laughs> this is a very funny comparison and in this picture again I like the overall image of nothing phone 1 more basically because of the color of the skies I mean nothing phone 1 is more closer to the reality and the skies color are a bit meshed up in the Nord 2 so because of that I will go with phone 1 in this image and in this image again I can say that if you see the above part the top part then nothing phone 1 did a very good job as compared to OnePlus Nord 2 in this image and in this image again the story goes and in this image also the story is same you will see some you know haziness in the image of OnePlus Nord 2 if you see the statue the sky is cloud whereas nothing phone one is very good you can see some crushed shadows in the plants but but in OnePlus Nord 2 that is good but still I mean overall I can say that you know Nord 2 is not looking that pleasing in this sort so yeah I will go with phone one now it's time for ultra wide so in ultra wide nothing phone one picks very dull photos as you can see so the consistency is not there between you know primary lens and ultra wide lens although this photo is very good it manages the exposure of the sun quite well but still it's looking very dull on the other hand Nord 2 is again taking warmer tones but still it's looking better than the nothing phone one if you know nothing just increase a bit saturation and maintaining the white balance will be very very good that can you know achieve via OT update so I hope to see some improvements it's really hard to trust that they will actually do it same story goes in this image as well like you can see that nothing phone one feels very dull as compared to Nord 2 yeah, it's more closer to the reality but still it doesn't looking pleasing to the eyes so I will definitely go with OnePlus Nord 2 in terms of ultra wide angle lens in daylight sorts in this sort, sort also you can see some flares in the image of Nord 2 and uh, but again at the same time it's more you know appealing to the eyes but i mean it's personal preference like which one you like more if you are okay with that dull colors then i guess you're going to okay with the sort of nothing phone one but overall nothing phone one needs more improvement even though it's a 50 megapixel ultra wide lens it's need more improvement now let's come to the human subject 
so in this photo i like both the images but when you zoom in at the face you will see some over sharpening in oneplus nord 2 image oneplus nord 2 takes very you know aggressive photo in terms of image processing whenever it you know detects face it's over sharpened even in this portrait shot you can see at my face that nothing phone one is actually quite good and it looks like you know the photo is taken on a very expensive phone well one thing i want to mention is that not to blurred those street lights beautifully whereas nothing phone one just disappeared those lights so that's very weird so good job not to in this regard now look at this photo how bad the oneplus nord 2 image looks so yeah in terms of you know human skin tones and human subject nothing phone one is the go-to phone if you you know click a lot of photos of human subject of your friends groups and something like that then i guess you should go with nothing phone one in low light sorts i guess that's a different story oneplus nord 2 is looking more appealing but in daylight if you are looking for a portrait and human subject uh, sorts then you should go with the nothing phone one well here is one random photo of me taking the you know photo of nature but if i talk about you know one area where oneplus nord you know did a too many you know blunders is when you take you know portrait shots against the sunlight you know like just look at this picture and i was shocked i was like is it a 30,000 phone or a 10,000 phone and I clicked the picture again in the same scenario and the results were the same and nothing phone one done a very very good job against the sunlight it, it managed the human skin tone and everything quite well even in this photo you can see that how good nothing phone one is looking against oneplus nord 2 and nord 2 is definitely struggling a lot in against the sunlight portrait source but one thing is very good in both the phones is the edge detection of the portrait source even at the tougher parts you can see that the blur and the edge detection is just so good in both nord 2 and nothing phone one so this is one thing to appreciate but overall if i you know talk about the details of the face and overall portrait sorts then definitely nothing phone one is ahead than the nord 2 all right guys so this is front camera of both the phones and 1080p 30 fps because yeah both phones can shoot only up to 1080p 30 there is no 4k mode and do let me know what you guys think about the stabilization i guess stabilization is good in both the phones i guess oneplus nord 2 is slightly better because in nothing phone one you won't get eis neither ois and this is against the sunlight well both phones overexpose the background the dynamic range is kind of weak from the front camera but i will actually see the footage in same screen and then i will judge that which phone is better in terms of overall uh, video quality but do let me know what you guys think about the audio quality all right guys so in terms of you know front video definitely nothing phone one is way ahead than the oneplus nord 2 in terms of image quality or in terms of noise cancellation and the audio quality is also very good in nothing phone one as compared to nord 2 so if you're looking to you know do vlogging from the front camera of your phone i guess nothing phone one is a better choice all right guys so this is now low light test and i am shooting this video from the rear camera of both the phones in 1080p 30 fps and do let me know what you guys think which one is better uh, monu told me that, that there is a huge color shifting in nothing phone one the picture the image looks darker as compared to the oneplus nord 2 but overall i guess nothing phone one is taking better you know overall quality and also do let me know guys about the audio quality and this is the low light test i will add more samples and now this is 1080p 60fps video sample and you can straight away tell that how good the footage of phone 1 is looking as compared to Nord 2. In Nord 2 the trees are looking very you know uh, very weird there is a overall green tint in the image and you can see the building behind the trees that how well exposed it is in phone 1 whereas Nord 2 is struggling to expose it correctly so definitely in terms of video quality phone 1 is ahead than Nord 2. Alright guys, so I'm doing more testing here of both the phones, OnePlus Nord 2 and Nothing Phone 1 and while recording the footage, I noticed one thing that we cannot switch the lenses from wide to ultra wide in any of these phones, even in 1080p 30fps, which is kind of bummer. Company should add this like to give the option to switch from wide to ultra wide lens because that is very helpful while recording the footage. Before that, you can do that obviously, before I mean recording the footage, you have to decide that you have to, you know, shoot in wide or ultra wide, but after recording, you can't choose to, you know, change the lenses all right now this is 1080p 60 fps and i enable the ultra steady mode in both the phones so i'm now going to run and check the stabilization that which phone has better stabilization <laughs> all right and this is how it works against the sunlight you will get a good idea that how is the dynamic range in both the phones and also do let me know what you guys think about uh, you know overall uh, 
audio quality and video quality this is human subject in the video you can see so monu what do you think which one is going to win i think one plus not is going to win <laughs> because he is the owner of one plus not so he thinks that all right now let's talk about low light shots so in low light i will say that there is not a huge difference but still there is a difference of again colors like you can see that not to produce as more boosted colors as compared to you know uh, nothing phone one and overall not to is better because it looks it gives you a dramatic feel the hdr is better in not to so nothing phone one is also not very far behind it needs some tweening here and there to improve the image quality in low light shots so i hope that nothing will actually work and you know give some good OTA updates to improve the camera of nothing phone one especially in low light scenario and, and also ultra wide camera needs too much improvement but if you look this sort then there is not much of a difference but definitely the sky is looking better in the nord 2 and also the dark roads and here in this image also the dark road and the more blue sky is looking good especially when we are talking about night sorts we need some dark elements in the sorts as well same goes in this as well yeah you may say that the shadows in the grasses are crushed but overall not to is looking more pleasing to the eyes all right guys now it's conclusion time so see first i'm going to point out that where nothing phone one is better so in terms of video hands down nothing phone one is better in terms of human skin tones human subject nothing phone one is better and in 50 percent of the part in daylight sorts you can say nothing phone one is better so this is the strong points of nothing phone one and also the versatility which brings the macro mode which is like a very you know very minor thing but yeah that's available here now in what regard oneplus not 2 is better than low light capability ultra wide shots and again as i told you 50 percent daylight shots were better in nothing phone one so of course 50 percent low uh, sorry daylight shots were better in oneplus nord 2 as well so yeah low light and uh, ultra wide angle lens is better in this phone but this ultra wide angle lens is so capable and i you know i have high hopes that with future ot updates nothing will improve the ultra wide angle lens of this phone so overall in conclusion I guess it's up on to your priorities like what you are going to suit more if you are a person who suit a lot of you know low light shots and also you need a good primary and ultra wide lens then OnePlus Nord 2 is the phone to go and if you have you know high priorities with videos and human skin tones then nothing phone one is the go to option for you so yeah that's it from today's video i hope you guys enjoyed this if you then smash the like button because you know to make videos like this i have to put too much effort so yeah for that effort you can give me a like and subscribe so yeah that's it from today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it thank you for watching i will see you very soon in my next video until then bye bye take care